If you're struggling to find enough job opportunities on online job boards and company websites, you'll definitely want to watch this video. Because in this video, I'm going to cover the six places to locate job opportunities that aren't on job boards. Hi, I'm Ian Jenkins, founder of JobHuntingSecrets.com, where we equip job seekers like yourself to find new opportunities in less time. Now, the most competitive part of the job market is found on online job boards company websites and LinkedIn. Why? Well, it's the easiest job market to tap into from the comfort of your sofa. However, there are a lot more job opportunities in the offline job market than appear on the online job market. So in this video, I'm going to share with you six places where you can find new job opportunities without facing the competition that you get online. Are you ready? All right, the first step is to identify the target company or companies where you want to work in. You see, too many of us are job hunting by convenience and we focus on only what's available and what we can win on job boards, but not anymore. What we're going to do is proactively identify where it is that we want to work and use that as our ground zero. Now, after you have a short list of target companies, expand the number of opportunities by looking at the very first place to find hidden jobs. You see, the first place to consider once you've got your target list finished is the suppliers for your target companies. See, many times the relationship between companies is so tight that it's hard to tell the difference between the supplier and the target company. So suppliers make an exciting option, especially if their clients are growing, because then they'll be growing as well. The second place to look is at a company's partners. You see, looking at your target companies, do they have any strategic joint ventures or alliances that are prospering as a result of working together? So for instance, if you look at the online music streaming services like Spotify or iTunes, they've been formed using new strategic licensing agreements and with music production companies. And these new partnerships come with new needs and opportunities which create jobs. All right, so let's move on to the third place. The third place to find hidden jobs is at distributors. You see, distributors sell and communicate your target company's value out to the market. So for instance, let's take Kellogg's. Kellogg's uses marketing agencies and grocery stores to help deliver the brand message of its products. Now, if Kellogg's products are doing well, then what are the chances that their distributor or channel partners have had a hand in that success? Pretty big, right? So a growing company is a hiring company. And that's what makes distributors an exciting place to look for hidden jobs. All right, let's move on to the fourth place. The fourth place is competitors. Now, although we might really cringe at the idea of working with someone who is competing against your target company, it might also be a source of an exciting job opportunity. You see, maybe you have a strategy for how this competitor can grow and become the industry leader or how you can help its uh, customers and its a customer experience. Now, although it might be difficult to open our minds to this source of jobs, competitors deserve attention when it comes to looking for hidden jobs. Now, let's move on to the fifth place. The fifth place that often gets overlooked, especially if it's been a while since we've graduated school, is our alumni network. You see, most schools maintain a form of, of an online alumni directory. And when you search alumni, you can often do it by company, industry, or location. Now, this alumni directory makes a very handy extension to LinkedIn because the big advantage of this source of jobs is that you share a common connection, a common bond with everyone in that database. And that makes it a whole lot easier for you to get in touch with them. All right, let's move on to the final and last place. The sixth place to look for hidden jobs is the SMB market. And SMB stands for Small and Medium Sized Business Market. Now, SMBs are companies with less than 500 employees and they account for 99% of the jobs in the US job market. Now, many of these companies don't have the time, money, or capacity to be posting jobs online. And so my favorite way to search for jobs in this market is to use Google and search fastest growing companies and then put the city that you live in or a region and where you live in. 
Now what you'll quickly find using this technique are the fastest growing companies who will often be hiring in order to maintain and keep up with the growth and the needs of their customers. So if you send a proposal on how you can help that company manage its growth, you'll likely land an interview and find a job before it's even been posted online. So now you've got an idea of the places of where you can find hidden jobs that aren't on online job boards. But based on your experience, where have been the best places to find jobs? We'd love to hear from you by sharing your experiences in the comments below. Now I hope you found this video valuable. If you'd like to know how I help job seekers get six interviews a week, then click on the link below in the description. And if you want to stay up to date on more helpful video tips like this, then make sure to subscribe. If you've got any suggestions for future videos, then let me know in the comments area. I'll talk to you soon.